Hello, my lovelies. Minxy Misty, it's <laughs> good looking at me. Oh God, I can't do it. <laughs> Hello my lovelies, Minxie Misty here, and today we're going to talk about inspiration. Um, what inspires you, that word itself has so many different meanings and there's so many different levels. And I just wanted to kind of tap onto that and explain, you know, for my first video, who's been an inspiration to me uh, and why that I am doing this uh, and also discuss who might be an inspiration to you uh, and things like that in your life. And, and, and the word inspiration, there's so many different levels that that could be and so many different things and experiences and people that could have been an inspiration to you or it could be, um, you know, what I'm doing could be a fellow YouTuber, which I'll get into that in the future, uh, somewhere down the line. So I've got a lot of inspiration there, a lot of inspirations. Otherwise, obviously, I wouldn't be here and I wouldn't be, be doing it for you guys. Uh, but there's quite a few, uh, and for various different re reasons, you know, energy levels and just the, the kindness, the sincerity that a lot of these people seem to have, which is another reason why I think that YouTube is a really, really bright direction uh, for the world to be heading in, in general. But maybe it's a family member, maybe it's a friend, maybe if you're an artist, it's someone artistically, or maybe it's someone musically inclined that might interest you. That word itself is such a huge word and it could make so much of a difference in the world in my opinion especially and particularly if we tried more more people tried to be the inspiration instead of looking for the inspiration I think because then you're guiding yourself you're trying to be the person that everyone else out there in the world looks at and looks up to which means you're being your better self and your best self and there's nothing better than you being your best self. Myself personally though, uh, besides obviously uh, YouTubers and just the idea of YouTube as a whole and how it's uh, expanded the possibilities for us to be more creative personally and to get our names out there uh, and to get our faces in front of people and just just a whole option, you know, whole array of creativity opened up there and allowing you to be yourself in front of people. It's just really great. But my inspiration has been familial, uh, family uh, inclined. A lot of it I have an aunt who has just really been an inspiration to me. And I had a, a great grandmother uh, who are just they're the nicest people that you could possibly know. Uh, and they've guided me a lot throughout my life. I, I don't think I ever told them or expressed to them, you know, or didn't, for my grandmother, didn't really have an, an, you know, a chance or an opportunity to do that, uh, to express, are you watching me? All right, this is so weird. <laughs> I'm rambling. I'm rambling because I'm nervous. <laughs> All right, I'll edit some of it out. That's my husband. Anyway. <laughs> but yeah, um, my grandmother, she, I mean, she used to pick cotton, just a tough lady. She would cook entire meals for like my whole family and invite other people in and I mean she lived to be over 90 years old long long time on this world and she just made a huge difference and a huge impact on my life and she just so many other people's life uh, an inspiration to them and touched them uh, she wanted to take care of the whole world it seemed like she'd go out she'd work hard all day and she would still come home every night and would cook a meal for not only my family, which was quite quite large, uh, but also for a lot of, uh, you know, the neighboring families and people that were around her. Uh, and I mean, the strength that there must have took in that, I, I don't know that I'll ever be there. I, I hope to be. Um, but I do know that it definitely, definitely inspired me. And just she had such a passion for life and such such a fight for life. And I just, I want to be that way. I, I want to be there and I want to help people and, you know, be able to, she tried to, it seemed like she tried to feed the world. And if I could do that, I would, 
totally do that and I, it was just admirable uh, with the strength that she had and I've, I'm always fighting for that strength as I'm sure so many of you are as well uh, and the person to look after and these are the type of people that you need in your life uh, and that make life worth living uh, and my aunt she she took care of uh, my grandfather was very sick and she she went through a lot of experiences because of uh, what she was doing for him and to take care of him and to help him uh, and guide him through uh, a lot of his sickness. She was a nurse, which I mean, nurses in general, what they do and the things that they see and the things that they hear. I've heard some stories. I have a friend uh, who is a nurse as well. <laughs> the things they say, say, see, I'll never <laughs> know or don't even know if I want to know. But, <laughs> but um, she went through uh, quite a few losses in her life. Uh, due to the self-sacrifice she gave for him and I'll, con I'll always throughout my life be indebted uh, to her for that um, you know just as important it was for her to take care of her father and to be there for him uh, and the sacrifices she made in order to do that was an inspiration to me of selflessness uh, that I can't explain beyond words and I, I myself like to think of myself as being very selfless and I, I believe that in order to be an inspiration to other people I find that to be very important to to be selfless and I think the world as a whole would be such a better place if more people were trying to be the inspiration instead of looking for the inspiration because then we would be the ones that are being better people in general as a whole we, we we're fighting to be that better person um, and a lot of a lot of the people nowadays are probably not what you should look yourself as an inspirational and are you really looking in the right areas for an inspiration and as an inspiration um, and can you change that about yourself and, and thrive to be the inspiration and would that better your life and would that better other people's lives and that's just kind of you know some of my thoughts on the word inspiration and how it can change the world and, and change you as an individual. Um, that's kind of some of the inspirations that I've had in my life. Uh, the list could obviously uh, go on and on because I'm very big fan of music, very big fan of comics and comic books. So and heroes, heroes are an inspiration to a lot of people. Superman, Batman, these these people these these ideas but what I'm suggesting is that you be the inspiration in the world and and you go out there and you try your best to be an inspiration to others and that way you will be your best and your better self and that's what I'm trying to do I'm reaching out to you guys in the hopes that some of you might try doing that because the first start to change in the world is changing yourself some of y'all leave some comments what's what's an inspiration to you who did you find kind of as growing up look after or look to or, or maybe who are you looking to now to inspire you and to guide you throughout your life um, and I think that's that's probably it so just want to tell y'all to thanks for watching and, and taking the time time out to hear me uh, set your goals high and you know always set your goals high and remember to love life and we'll see you next time Bye-bye.